uh, hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how basically you can compile your html and convert that into pug template language formerly known as jet you will be using a package in node.js which is html to pug which will compile your html code to pug templating language so it has got 3000 weekly downloads and basically now this is a demo here inside the browser so inside this you will copy paste your html inside the text area so i will paste the html here and there is a button out there which will compile to pug as i hit this button guys you will see basically it will convert this to a pug uh, template language here and you can simply copy this and paste it inside the file so this is basically the application so you have seen many converters out there which does the same thing if you type here html to pug online so there are various converters out there which also does the same thing so we will be using this application and designing this tool here basically in node.js and express so let's start the tutorial so i have given a, all the source code in the description of the video so i have written a complete blog post step by step so you can go to the description of the video to download all the source code so now first of all you need to go to your command line and install basically these package which is express which will be the web server we are using and secondly we just need to install html2 pug pug so just install these two packages here and now basically we will start this from scratch and also we will be using basically template engine which is ejs so you just need to install that dependency also simply install it npm i ejs so in simply install this uh, package as well so now basically now inside your index.js uh, we will basically start our express application so we will simply require it and basically we will start a application here We will start a new express application and basically we will listen on port 5000 and basically in the callback we will simply say here app is listening so we will basically make a get request here so someone goes to the home page and we will render out a template here which is index.ejs so now we need to set the view engine also so we will simply use this method app.set view engine and ejs and also guys for uh, the forms we also need the body parser middleware also so simply require it and here we just need to pass the middleware functions which is url encoded extended to false and uh, body parser json so these two lines are very much necessary when working with forms here so now we just need to make this index.ejs file so just create a views folder inside your root directory and inside this we will make index.ejs file here so basically this will contain a simple form here which will have the text area and here basically we will have a simple form this will make a simple post request to this route which is html to pub method will be post and inside this we will have a simple text area where we will allow the user to write the html so here the user will write the html and then we will simply got a button here which will say compile html to pug that's all so whenever submits uh, user submits the form here it will make this post request so now we just need to write this post request so we will simply make it app dot post html to pug and basically we will have a callback function here and inside this callback function we will get the html guys which is request dot body dot html this needs to be the name attribute whatever name attribute you have given here this will need to have the same name attribute after this we will basically convert this to pug so for this we just need to require that package that we installed here which is html to pug so we will simply require it that's all and we will basically use a method which is basically 
it will declare a variable pug and here we will use this this is basically we will need to pass the HTML here so we will pass the HTML and basically inside it takes an options so we can simply pass here taps to true this is basically an option that you can pass that's all and now we can simply re-render this bug here inside this template we can render out this once again and this time we can pass the data to this template which is pug is equal to pug that's all and when we load the page for the very first time we just need to say pug is empty that's all so this is the basically the advantage of using ejs embedded javascript templates you can also pass some information as well now to basically display this information we have a syntax here we can simply display this so here we will simply check here inside this this is basically the syntax so this is the variable name we will surround this using percentage this sign and here we will display the value which is this one that's all and basically columns will be 30 here rows will also be 30 and also we just need to close it that's all so this is basically the syntax guys and now if i try to run the application localhost 3000 i think the server is not running so nodemon index.js sorry i have started that on 5000 so here basically guys we just need to copy the sample html compile it and here now you can see this is basically the converted pug template engine a pug language or you may also call it as jade as well so this is basically the converter that we have built here guys you will see if i once again write this you can see that so in this way you can build out this converter using this package inside node.js express all the source code is given in the description of the video thank you very much